In this video, we'll get up close and personal with Groove Machine's filters and envelopes. A filter is what gives a synth its sonic signature. As its name implies, a filter allows some sounds to pass and other sounds to be filtered out. There are three basic types of filter in Groove Machine. Low pass, band pass, and high pass. There's also an EQ on the equalizer tab. Each filter cuts off different frequency ranges. For example, the low pass filter allows low frequencies to pass and cuts off the higher ones. Listen to how the different filter types change the sound. Now exactly where this cutoff in frequency happens is determined by the cutoff control, like this. The other control here is for resonance. Resonance is sound triggered by other sound. That's similar to feedback in some ways, which is why it can lend a whistling or ringing quality to the output, like this. Keep in mind that every drum part and every synth part has its own filter for maximum sonic control. The envelope generator is the other tool central to any sound design. An envelope controls how a sound behaves over time. It can control how quickly something starts, known as its attack time, what level it drops to, called its decay. It can control what level it sustains and how quickly the sound releases. The most obvious thing to control with an envelope is volume or amplitude. Groove Machine has a dedicated amplitude envelope right here. And just like the filter controls, every part gets its own amplitude envelope. So if you want synth part two to fade in, bring it into focus by clicking on it, then increase its attack time. And you also have two assignable envelope generators for every part. This one is a little more stripped down. You only have controls for attack and decay, plus an amount slider to determine how dramatically the effect is applied. But the cool part is that you can make this envelope control all kinds of things. You can route it to the filter cutoff frequency, the amount of modulation, the frequency filter, or the speed of the LFO, which we'll cover in another video. So if I want the filter to open slowly for that cool wow effect, I can set the envelope destination to filter and then set a long attack time. And be sure to increase the amount setting. And down here at the bottom, see this switch? You actually get two assignable envelope generators for every part for maximum impact. For more great software, visit the ImageLine online shop. And for more great tutorials, visit StreamWorksAudio.com.